Hey guys, I hope you saw. I don't know if I if this is just gonna be the video or if I edited in other stuff. I'm not entirely sure yet. But anyway. I just want to Toys R Us to get a few things. Now, first, all I wanted to do was get one Amiibo for the giveaway. And this video is going up after the giveaway ends, so I'm pretty sure. So, like, if you're seeing this, I doubt you, I doubt you can win any of these. Because it already would have passed. And, okay, so first, I'm just going to show you the Amiibo. So, this is what... I, and, and we haven't done the giveaway yet, so I don't know which one we we're giving away. I still have to decide with Harry. I'm just going to keep one the giveaway one. First thing I got was Villager. This one, I think we're going to do the giveaway on because Villager's like really cool. Like, I've never seen a Villager in my life. And the guy at Toys R Us, the guy at Toys R Us was really cool. I don't want to say your name just in case he didn't want to be on YouTube, but he was like the coolest dude ever. He was like totally into Amiibo and Doctor Who and all that stuff. I like Legos. He was like the best. He was like, they originally had like four a villager amiibos, and then that was it. And then like, they just ran out for like months, and then they got like a restock of like, and they had like fifty or sixty amiibo of villager. But then when I got there, this was the last one, and like yeah, like it was like not even it was like in the area where they're like the, the cashiers are. And then I was like, is anyone going to buy that Amiibo? And then he was like, no, you can have it. And then I was like, yes. So that's what I'm thinking it's going to be the giveaway. <coughs> Next, which might be the giveaway, but probably isn't, is Shovel Knight. Uh, I, I was only going to get one Amiibo. Um, and same thing with Shovel Knight. He just got restocked, so they had like a few of him, though. Um, I was I really want to get the Shovel Knight game, because it looks really cool. I've seen the, I've seen the Game Crumbs play it, but... Anyway, so I went to Toys R Us, and then I was going to get this, and then I saw a sticker, and it said, buy one, get one, 40% off. So, that was great, because I got this really cool looking Amiibo, and this really, I don't know, I don't know if he's rare, but it's an Amiibo. So, I got these dank memes right here. Uh, one of them was for full price, let's just say he was, and then I got him for like $8, which was superb. So the next, I'm just walking along, and then I'm like, yo, I, and I, I, I like Legos, but I've never done Lego Dimensions before. And I was like, hmm, I've always wanted one of these. Let's see if I get a, uh, let's just get a Doc Brown Fun Pack, because I, like, I'm into Back of the Future, and this looks really cool. So I got this. And then I see a sign that says, all Lego Dimensions 50% off. So then... I was like, oh my gosh, they're 50% off, let me get the Doctor Who one also, because I am a huge fan of Doctor Who. And then I was like, you know, if these are both 50% off, this equals just one of the packs. So then I thought to even it out, I would get another one, and another one. No, that's it, there's no more. But, so anyway, I have... Doctor Who Dimensions uh, Fun Pack, I believe they're called. Yeah, Fun Pack. With um, Cyberman and the da Dalek. And then I have the Doc Brown and the Train. And what I'm going to do with these, obviously, I'm going to open one of each. And then probably do like a video of it and review. And then the other one I'm just going to put in here. If you guys don't know, there's just like a chest in my room. Where I have a bunch of sealed Lego sets. And I thought these would be very good Lego sets because... <laughs> I believe these are, no, they might not be first wave, but they're probably, they're, they're second wave, I think. Um, Lego Dimensions, and then if Lego Dimensions ever gets really popular, and people want these, I'll have them sealed in the box. And if they're not popular, I'll have these sealed in the box, and then they'll be rarer. And the cool thing about this is that Cyberman has very, very, oh, focus very detailed printing and there's a Dalek but I already have one in that Doctor Who set over there um so that's a thing and then Doc Brown gotta keep this one sealed with the train and Doc Brown which again this is the same Doc Brown that I also have over there but his hair is different and better so uh, I guess that concludes it for this haul uh if I don't edit in the first part it's gonna be like five minutes and if I do then it's gonna be like more than that so yeah lego dimensions and amino hunt mm, yeah